Okay, so let us try to understand how the hydraulic circuit works. So here we are taking into consideration the regenerative circuit. The regenerative circuit is used to increase the outstroke speed of the piston of a double acting cylinder. This figure shows a regenerative hydraulic circuit which is used to speed up the operation of the cylinder during its outstroke. So this is the outstroke of the circuit. It uses three position four way direction control valve with its port to block as shown over here. And the lines to both the ends of the cylinder are connected in parallel. So here we can see this line and this particular line they are connected in parallel to each other. Now in the given particular position from the reservoir when the motor drives the pump the fluid enters into the filter. The fluid gets filtered and it is pumped by this pump and it will be going to this port P and then to the reservoir. So this is the neutral position or block position. Nothing will happen in this particular case. Now when we operate the direction control valve in such a way that the spool of the four-way direction control valve is in the right envelope mode. So suppose let us consider this the right envelope mode. Then from port P, it will try to go to this particular port, but it is blocked. So the fluid from this line, it will enter into the rod end of the cylinder and will cause the retraction of this and the liquid from the blind end of the cylinder from port 3 it will enter over here and from 1 it will go to the port R. So we can say that as this is the block position the fluid will go from this line and will enter into the rod end of the cylinder and will cause the backward motion of this particular rod of this particular piston rod of the cylinder and the liquid from the blind end of the cylinder from port 3 it will go to the reservoir R as shown over here. Now when the spool of four way direction control valve is in the left envelope mode then as you can see over here from reservoir the fluid will enter into the filter from filter to the pump from pump to the port P from P to 1 and from 1 to this 3 port and it will 3 port and it will enter into the blind end of the cylinder and will cause the piston and piston rod to move in the forward direction. Now apart from this particular pump flow which is there the liquid from the or the fluid from the rod end of the cylinder will also get added to this flow of the pump and we can say that the volume of the fluid that is supplied to the blind end of the cylinder is greater than the pump flow rate. And therefore, the speed of extension of the piston in a cylinder is greater than the retraction speed. So this is known as the regeneration. So in this way, the regenerative circuit is used for increasing the speed of the piston in the forward direction or fit direction.